Ah, fresh, clean air. Magnificent, eh? <laughs> Magnificent. Oh. I've never seen these before. Oh, delightful. Better than my silver jubilee roses back home. Good heavens! <laughs> Extraordinarily odiferous, fast opening, and oh, uh, since I've never seen them here before, apparently quick spreading. <laughs> uh, only one visible cultivar. It, oh, oh. <laughs> choo, choo. Well, that was rather bold for a woodpecker. Hmm. I. Uh, uh, where was I? Oh, yes, oh, yes. One cultivar. Uh, <laughs> A tree, you confounded bird! There! You can have my helmet! Are you quite happy now? Oh my! I enjoy traveling. It's good to get back to our jungle. Mm. The Waziri village was nice. Oh, it was wonderful. But there's no place like home. Well, here you go, Tarzan. Give this a whirl. What do I do with this? What, you don't know how to whistle, big boy? You just put your lips together and blow. Yes, and it makes a sound. Oh. <laughs> I, I didn't hear anything. Well, of course you didn't, nature boy. You see, it's a dog whistle. Yeah, dogs have super sensitive ears. They can hear things we humans can't. We've got a couple of hundred of these beauties already made. Yeah, we figure we'll corner the local market on dog whistles. So how many can I put you down for? 10, 20? Yes, well, as nicely crafted as your dog whistle is, I must point out that I've never actually seen a, a dog anywhere near here. Oh, looks like we got a problem. Positive pooches. Yeah, a real doggy drought. Canine catastrophe. Yeah, what we need is a bulldog blow-up. <sighs> home sweet home. I can't wait to see Daddy. Oh, Dumont certainly has been busy. I wonder what this is all about. Ah, Jane, you have returned. Did you miss me during your trip? Actually, Monsieur Demont, I didn't think of you at all. Oh, you wound me, madame. But you'll be interested to see that my trading post is on the rise. We're installing more guest beds, a new radio tower, which will allow us to order supplies from all around the world, and by week's end, hot and cold running water. All the comforts of home. You should consider moving closer. <laughs> I'm as close as I'd like to get. Thank you very much. Tarzan? Ah, my friend. This type of thing isn't exactly your uh, strong suit. <laughs> what is it? A puzzle. The object is to remove the ring without breaking the toy. Ah. Unfortunately, the key to solving the puzzle is brains, not brawn. 
And what do you mean by that? No, no, relax, Tarzan. It was merely a warning shot. The animals have been acting unusually bold this week. <laughs> but surely you realize I would never allow one of my men to harm your animals. You fear me. Hmm. I would be a fool not to. You would. Indeed. What's the matter, love? Oh, I hope it wasn't that ridiculous brains brawn comment of Dumont's. You are a keenly intelligent man. That's not what's bothering me. Listen. I don't hear anything. Exactly. <sighs> no birds, no monkeys, altogether too quiet. Maybe it's nothing. There's a riot in here. Something's going on in this jungle. Something bad. <gasps> we need to find Daddy! Daddy, are you here? Professor! Professor! I can't find him, he's gone. Yes, well, panicking won't help the situation now, will it? We'll just focus on figuring out what is going on in this jungle. First, both our treehouse and Daddy's base camp have been thrown into disarray. Why? Were they searching for something? And if so, what? We didn't see any animals in the jungle either. Where are they? Yes, yes, well, this is turning out to be quite a puzzle. <sighs> Turk! Tantor! Where have you been? Trying to get away. Get away? From what? The ringing. It won't stop! Oh, it just rings and rings and rings! Animals acting peculiarly, rambling on about the ringing. Make the ringing stop! <laughs> Turk, what are you doing? Turk! Go! <laughs> Turk? I don't know, but I think we're safe for now. <laughs> yes, that would have been fun. If it wasn't so utterly terrifying. The 
this obviously isn't restricted to Turk and Tantor. I think all the jungle animals have been affected. But what's causing it? These flowers. I've never seen them before. There are some flowers that only bloom once every 50 years. Could a plant make an animal go mad? Perhaps the pollen from these plants is causing some sort of allergic reaction. We should find a good specimen to study. Yes, yes. The more I think about it, the more I'm sure we found a... <gasps> Jane, what's wrong? Daddy! <laughs> I hope he didn't suffer too much. Don't give up yet. Maybe we can learn something from this. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> I, I, I suppose Daddy would have wanted it that way. Huh. I was taking a hike this morning when I came across a beautiful red flower. Unfortunately, while admiring the blossom, I had a most unusual encounter. With a great swarm of woodpeckers! <laughs> The situation looked grim. Fortunately, I kept a calm head. Used my formidable jungle skills. And made it home alive. Over the next few days, I had more and more alarming experiences with usually benign creatures. Why were the animals suddenly acting so curiously? The only new element in the jungle was that mysterious red flower. I knew there had to be a connection. We were right about the flowers. I began work on an antidote. But my base camp was no longer safe. So I retreated to Tarzan and Jane's treehouse. I eventually did concoct an antidote, but while I was waiting for the chemicals to finish their reactions, the animals attacked en masse. Stop it! Stop the ringing! <laughs> I was forced to hide the antidote and flee. If I fail to reach help and Tarzan, Jane, or some other poor soul finds this journal, then know that the antidote that will reverse all this madness is hidden under the P. What's a P? Not P, the letter P. And that's all he wrote. Well, at least we know there's a cure for this madness. Somewhere in the treehouse. to hurry. It's under something that starts with the letter P. Pots? It's not under the papers. Oh, pillows. Oh, nothing here either. Oh, we don't have much time. <laughs> ringing. Ringing. Oh, we've looked under every single P in this house. Perhaps we misunderstood Daddy's meaning. Phonograph. That starts with a P. I found it! A P word, not a P sound. Those reading lessons really are paying off. I think the antidote's working. Think again. Ringing. Stop the ringing. They're not the only ones we need to worry about. Make it stop! We have to get out of the jungle. But how? Come on.
Probably. Well, at least we're safe for the moment. Professor. Daddy! Oh, Daddy! When I found your journal, I feared the worst. I've been in hiding for days. The animals have gone mad, you know. <laughs> yes, we know. What's going on? They're digging. You must go to the treehouse and get my antidote. It's on the phonograph. We did, Daddy. It didn't work. Impossible! I was certain my antidote would counteract the flower's pollen. Maybe. It's not the flowers at all. What else could it be? I mean, nothing has changed in the jungle. Nothing at all. There is one thing. The tower. The tower? Whatever you're doing, Tarzan, do it quickly. Question. How did I get here? Huh? Mrs. Tarzan? Professor? Tantor? Are you all right? Um, I, I think so. The last thing I remember was a really awful ringing in my ears. I thought I was gonna go nuts. <laughs> what? The most horrible part of this whole experience is the knowing. The knowing? The knowing. Knowing that lurking deep inside of me is a monster. A vicious monster who, at any moment, without warning, could re-emerge to savage the world once again. I fear carefree and innocent Tantor is lost to us forever. Oh, brother. You have it too, Turk. Aren't you worried about carefree and innocent Turk? Leave me alone! You can run from your problems, Turk, but you can't run from yourself. I can run from you! Hmm. My tower was causing the animals to go mad? Yes. Humans couldn't hear it, but the animals could. <laughs> I didn't realize you were such a detective, Tarzan. Well, there's much about me you don't know. <laughs> what are you smiling about? Oh. 